Hey guys, this is Godzilla 2010, and today we're going to be talking about what Godzilla vs. King Kong happened, you know, in the Legendary Universe. I've been, there has been lots of rumors and, you know, lots of, you know, like information, like Monarch's going to exist in, you know, Skull Island, King Kong, and all of this stuff, it doesn't, <laughs> has not been confirmed at all. But here's the thing. This film has not been confirmed. Everybody think, well, lots of, um, you know, articles have been saying, oh, it's confirmed. It's like, no, it's not. It has not been confirmed. Now, let's, you know, causing all of this stuff to happen, some copyright, you know, basically just some copyright issues and, you know, that kind of stuff. So, Universal will not, um, no longer be backing um, King Kong Skull Island. So now, it's just Legendary and Warner Brothers, who both had the rights to Godzilla, and... Now, Onwards has the rights, you know, to make a King Kong film, so that has helped, you know, with the possibilities of King Kong vs. Godzilla being in vain. But here's an issue. If Toto doesn't like it, we can just pull the plug, and this whole legendary trilogy and everything, it's just gone. And if this, if they actually are trying to make this a thing, it's not going to happen until the Godzilla trilogy is over. Until they, you know, don't really want to do with that. And, you know, after we're done, you know, with Skull Island or any sequels to that film, if they decide to do so. And, you know, then they have to be done with the Sir Grimm, they want to throw that in. Because they can't just cross this over in the middle of their, you know, series. It's like, you can't just have, for Godzilla 2, you know, have Godzilla fight King Kong, and in Godzilla 3, it, don't, it doesn't change anything. You just can't do that, and it kind of ruins, you know, you know, like, dark feeling that they're trying to give of the Godzilla Legendary Trilogy. So, they would definitely do this as, like, you know, as definitely maybe an end to the Godzilla trilogy. But the thing is, if they want to be, like, you know, the superhero films, they need to continue these series. And, you know, just ending it on Godzilla vs. King Kong is a great ending. But then you, you're kind of done, and superhero movies will probably just keep on going after that. So, you know, I don't want to say they're going to continue just doing these crossover films because of superhero films, but, you know, I'm just saying... <laughs> You know, this film's not going to come out for a very long time, and people are reaching hold their breath or get their hopes up because it might not even happen at all. Even though, like, you know, even though the copyright, you know, changes are helping the chances of this film, and it was always a possibility. You know, as soon as Skull Island was confirmed to be, a, you know, a thing, like a new King Kong movie was confirmed, we kind of all knew that it was a possibility. Of Godzilla fighting King Kong. It was always a possibility ever since Skull Island was confirmed, you know, be with Legendary Wonder Brothers or, you know, whoever was going to be working with Universal to make that film when it was first confirmed. So, you know, it's there's always been the chance of a sp film being a thing, but it's never been confirmed. It hasn't been confirmed. And it won't be for a very long time because, you know, it's just how it, they're not going to just say, oh, here's King Kong vs. Godzilla, it's going to happen in, like, 2020. <laughs> We're not going to do that. There's no point in confirming it. Like, you know, that it's going to be that far in the future. It just doesn't make any sense. Like, so, yeah, people really need to think this through. It's, you know, this whole thing's not going to happen anytime soon. And we're not going to save it's the next ca on Comic-Con or anything. But, you know, with these changes, you can tell that someone... I want to be ordinary. It's definitely thinking about this, and, you know, thinking how much money they can get out of this, you know, Hall of Fame. Now here's the thing: if, it, if ordinary goes to the Ho Ho and saying we want Godzilla to fight King Kong, of course they're always gonna look at you know how the last King Kong versus Godzilla did. And they're going to see that it did very well, <laughs> and so they'll probably say go ahead because that's, we're still getting you know money off of how much you know is Godzilla. Legendary movies make are still getting money off of this, actually. <laughs> so, if they see that right, Godzilla and King Kong do well, you know, back in, like, the 60s, they're probably going to say, do it again, because they're the ones who are still, you know, they're still getting quite a bit of, you know, of a profit off of this film, so obviously they're going to say, yes, yeah, go ahead, which is, yeah, they're probably going to say that, but, you know, I'd be surprised if they didn't, if, you know, Legendary brought this up. You know, if they're doing as well as it did back in the 60s. But, you know. So, that's kind of where it's at right now. It's definitely leaning more on it's going to happen side, but it's not confirmed. It's not 100% it's going to happen. And even if they do announce they're going to start working on it, 
it still might not happen. <laughs> so, yeah, don't get your hopes up, but it is definitely leaning more on the side if I, it can happen. So, I'm not saying it won't. It could easily happen. They can, you know, easily announce this, like, tomorrow. <laughs> you just never know what they're going to do. They could announce this whenever they want. You know, they can release this whenever they want. They can... I'm not in control of what they do. So, it's a possibility, but don't get your hopes up. It's not confirmed. I don't know why people are saying that. Not everyone is, but some people are. But, you know, that's just where it's at right now. It is definitely a possibility. They could easily do this. It's just a matter of if they want to and if Toho wants them to, you know, if Toho is fine with them doing that. That's where it comes down to. And, you know, when we're going to do it, it's definitely a big issue with it. But that's really um, all that's happening with Godzilla vs. King Kong. So, if you have any more information, um, you know, give me a link in the description below, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, and I'll see you guys later.